Let's see what Jethro says. I have been meditating on and off for quite a few years, but I still catch myself holding tension in my face, especially around my mouth. Is there anything I can, should do? The face is quite common. It's quite common to, to cleanse your jaws. There's also something that happens with the tongue for me. The tongue just gets sucked up into the tip, I mean the top of my mouth. And there seems to be very little I can do with that. Uh, but what you can do is continuously throughout the meditation, you check in and see, are you tensing up? And then you try to let go of that. There, there are some people who say you should just completely still don't move anything. But relaxation and effortlessness is a big part of what we're aiming for. So if you're sitting and you feel like you have tension around your, your face, your mouth, could you describe it a little bit more, what kind of tension it is? Because there's things that go down here that there can be a lot of tension, a lot of pressure. There's also, um, um, what do you call those? Nadis or energy points, chakras, if you want, whatever you want to call them. There's points where you can get a lot of pain when you meditate. Like I have a few points here. And if, like I said, when you sit a lot, you can feel like you have problems with your teeth or like a jaw or there's something just grinding inside there and that can just be something that's stuck when you sit over and over more that tends to just loosen up so one of the things you actually could do Jethro pursing your lips slightly yeah try doing like this just do everything you can to just loosen up but one thing you can do if it's something that's stuck is to go to an intensive retreat like where you sit 10 days I highly recommend the Guenka retreats. I call them the McDonald's of the, the meditation because they're everywhere and they're they're built on the machine metaphor, same as McDonald's. So you can go anywhere and have a similar experience no matter where in the world you are. And if you have something that's blocked, there's a high likelihood that that would get cleared out uh, from going into a more intensive retreat. But well, it's semi-intensive. It's like 10 hours per day for 10 days. So it's pretty intensive, but it's only for 10 days. I hope that answered it, Jethro, by the way. Um, I just check in the whole time and quite often I see like, also I have tension in my, my shoulders. So then I just do like this and that's fine. Just let go of all the tension and then you start again. And then sometimes it's just impossible because there's like tension coming and then, well, you can try changing your posture is also something you can do. Uh, you can sit in the diamond position, the one where you fold your legs underneath. That's a really good position to change up with. 